There are a ton of catfish in Lake Erie. Channel cats are by far the most popular and they're the most fun to catch. They spend most of their time in the big lake, but then in the spring, they make their way into the many creeks, and that's the best time to catch them, especially from the banks. The best thing is you don't need a ton of fancy equipment to catch them. Here's my basic setup. I use a multi-purpose, medium to heavyweight, seven foot spinning rod. Any spinning reel will work, but remember, these are big fish, so you want something that's definitely durable. You're gonna want at least 10 pound test. I like to use a circle hook, typically one or one aught. There's a lot of current in the creek, so you're definitely gonna want a good sinker to keep your bait in place. I use a three quarter up to a one ounce weight, depending on the current. So I like to use the Carolina rig. It's the swivel with the sinker, then about a 16 inch leader that goes right to your circle hook. But the most important thing is your bait. So catfish have a very keen sense of smell, so you want a bait that stinks. Things like chicken liver, shrimp, but definitely my favorite, hot dogs. You're gonna wanna put a little bit of garlic and vinegar with that too to get it real stinky. Before you get out there, make sure to set out your shrimp and your chicken liver on the hood of your truck to let it just rot in the sun. Legend has it that you wanna keep your chicken liver and shrimp out in the sun for at least a day before you send it out into the creek. Get ready, because when you hook into one, they're strong, and you're really gonna have to drag that puppy in. Well, it's not a puppy, it's a cat. <sighs> I go cat fishing for the sport of it. You can't eat them, but I prefer to let them go to be caught again. Hopefully these tips will help you catch some of these whiskered bandits. I'm John DeMarco, and that's this week's fishingonline.com in-depth look.